So what are you sorry for? <laughs> Congratulations! This is it from Olainka and Amara. It seems great for well. Yes. As you can probably tell, I'm freaking out. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. You know, wasting your experience and all the love and all that good stuff. Nigeria is way more stressful for me when you guys hear me. Like us, let's Nigeria! <laughs> yeah! Hey, God! Hey! This is your friend of mine. This is your friend of mine. This is your friend of mine. The lesbian. The lesbian. The lesbian. The lesbian. The lesbian. I'm a Drink it while we can. Baby, I'm ready. Well, I didn't want to go to the airport with like a bomb. So even though it's 6 o'clock in the morning, it's 6.30. I'm wearing a white dress. I'm looking all pretty because, you know, this is the image of me that my babe will have for a very long time. The last time she saw me. So <laughs> let's be in a white dress. And then, look at my tattoo. <laughs> look at my tattoo. Them, like, we yeah, we showed them. Yes. So, like, us on to. Yes. We're supposed to make a video of her saying goodbye, but we didn't have time. In fact, we didn't have time for a lot. So, like, I say goodbye. Let the highlights and hit you. Say goodbye, say goodbye. <laughs> goodbye, I mean, see you later, not goodbye. This is a see you later for you and her relationship and you can follow her on instagram to baby let's go into the you can follow her on instagram to follow up on her and check up on her and all of that and you know she she has promised to post more because now i'll be on her instagram and i'll be posting more too because that's what i do when she's not around me i post so much because i know she's looking like what are you doing yeah so follow us on instagram follow her on instagram and you know more about her baby you didn't say the bye bye you just say good for you so she's tired. And I've been well, you, it was quite a ride from the start to now, and it was nice. It was, it was a lot. It was nice. It was a lot. <laughs> it was a lot. Honestly, one day I'll tell you how it was a lot, but it was a lot, my baby. Yeah. But yeah, it's been a pleasure. You know, gracing your strings and all the love and all of that good stuff. <laughs> yeah, see my baby go. <laughs> see my baby go. It's been amazing. Thank you. Please show her love. Take your bow with me. Yes, sir. <laughs> Take your bow with my baby. See you soon again. It go be now. See you soon. See you soon. Mm -hmm. Adios. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. This is it from Olainka and Amara. Same screen for a while. Yes. 
four minutes. We need to go see pretty ways. So this is it. Thank you for being there throughout the ride for the past one year. Thank you. Thank you so much. You want to cry? Don't cry again. Okay. She wrote to me later, it's my bag. <laughs> and she also wrote me another one that is in the house that will be very good. And that's one I'm dreading. <sighs> I'm dreading going back to that house alone. Sure. <laughs> I love you. I love you so much. <laughs> You see, you see how fine I'll be. Yes, yeah, you see. I'll show you every day. This is mine. Yes. So, are we good then? Mm-hmm. Let's go, let's go. Let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. Let go, let go, let go. I can't take the camera on me because I don't have strength, so bye. I'll see you before I come up from the airport, alright? Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Hi. Hello. Everybody, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Alone. <laughs> ah. Whew. Well, I can give me a survival kit. <laughs> it has memory. Um, I say memory card. It has ATM card, cash, ID card. Because. If you've been watching this channel long enough, you know I never carry anything out. I usually am the one walking around, the Inca pays for everything because she handles the bag that contains everybody's even ID. When we go to a place, Inca gives them my ID because I don't handle things on my own usually since she's been back into the country. But now that she's living in this country, I have to start, you know, carrying my own ID and my own cash and my own ATM card around. So yeah, she prepared this kit for me to carry my neck like a baby. <laughs> She was actually worried about me and how I need lip balm. <laughs> I need my baby to come and give me lip balm. She was actually worried about me and how I would, you know, deal without her. But you know, I'm fine. I'll be fine. It's just I miss her. It's all. I miss her so much. Yeah, this is it. So I need to pack my shit, my things. I have a flight in two hours back to Abuja because I don't want to be in Lagos one night, another night without Lanka. I don't, I can't, I don't think I can stay in Lagos this period without Lanka. So my flight is this afternoon. And my things are all over the place, and, and even myself, I'm all over the place. My emotions are all over the place. That's why I need to go back to my bed, to my house, the house I know, to the house that knows me. I need to be held by things that know me. I need to hold things that know me. <laughs> Anywho, I promise Tinka I won't cry. So, we're not going to cry because she's going to watch this video. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm so excited because this is something she has been working for for so long. Ah, it's all good news actually. That's why I'm trying to not be sad, or even though I'm missing her so much, I'm trying to remind myself all of these things are good things. As much as I'm you know, feeling things. I just I'm reminding myself that this is good. What's happening right now? They are good things, and I'm grateful for them. And I'm, and I'm joyous. And <sighs> let me pack sure if I miss my flight. I just yeah, we'll talk better in Abuja. Yeah, we'll talk. We'll talk in Abuja. Actually. Let me just pack. Let me pack. Because I do not want to miss my flight. I need to go back to my house. It's a need. I need. I need back to my house. Um, I'll just put things inside here. I, I don't want to have to deal. I really don't want to deal. I am physically single. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my. But look at me though, I'm married. I mean, I told you all since we were now that I'm married, I've been married. You couldn't believe me, so here's my yes. I am actually. I think when it gets hard, I'll just on my camera and be recording because a wave of sadness just hit me right now. And I ran to this camera and let it run to just carry it and on it. I saw a lion cast toothbrush. And I was just like, yo, she left her brush. Yo, can I can I run over and give it to her? And I realized she's not even in the country. Guy. Okay. 
She's not going to be the same continent. <laughs> yeah. Amo. <sighs> so Laika left me her watch, which I'm going to wear now because I want to always know what the time is. That's something Inka is good at. She, I, I don't know. I don't know how to wear a watch. I've never been a watch person. But Inka always wear, wears a watch, even when we're going to run. <laughs> so she always tells me what the time is. <laughs> Anywho, I'm almost ready for I'm almost ready to leave the hotel room. Uh, as people can tell I'm probably I say I'm probably as people can probably tell I'm freaking out right now. I know she's freaking out too. And the good thing is, the plane she's on has Wi Fi. So I feel like that's just God looking out for us because we need to be in communication at this period. The <laughs> that I'm talking about it sounds like our relationship is for the only relationship, but it's not, trust me. It's not. We're not. I don't know, there's this thing they used to call it. People call it on the internet codependent or whatever it is. There's this unhealthy dynamics people have talked about on the internet. On the internet. That's, not what, that's not what is happening. We're just really good friends and really enjoy each other. And we've spent, we've spent the past one year plus together, constantly together. So this is a very, huh? it's a shock. It's a culture shock to what we, are, what we are used to. It's a different culture. <laughs> As far as I'm concerned, this is a different culture. I have, to, I have to figure out how to, you know, continue navigating life now as a single, <laughs> physically single person. <sighs> Anywho, this is what a married, <laughs> don't forget I'm married, yo, a married queer person. Who is living in Nigeria? It looks like on a Wednesday afternoon. I mean, that might quite person is me, Amara, in case you did not grasp that. <laughs> that person is me. So, yeah, let's come and be going. Nika said I should order my ride and that my ride should be here before one o'clock. I should leave the hotel by one o'clock when my ride should be here before one o'clock. So I have to go and order my ride. See, but Nika handles this shit like all the ride, everything about. Now I have to be extra alert and extra careful. Because, you know, the ones where I know they handle, not how they handle them. The ones where I be they handle, I still handle that one. Okay. So, I finished this round of cry. <coughs> I'm alright, I'm alright. Uh, I love you. Olenka, you. I love you so much. <laughs> Let us come and be going because we shall not delay. This one has finished. Oh, it did finish it, Paul. Once I put my dark mask now, I'll look like don't talk to me, don't talk to me, I'm not your friend. Anywho, I just want to have a little quiet time and small time. Yes, Yinka, I'm having small time. In between all of this, and I'll make it. Don't worry, I'm fine. I'll be late. I promise. So yes, you go now. Let me fix myself up. <laughs> God, I know what the time is, babe. There's a watch on my hand. I'm fine. <laughs> Hey people, 
Ah, can you see me? There's no light. Oh, <laughs> I'm home. I'm home. I'm home and there's no light. Nepa no even want to walk on me and say this one that your baby has left the country. Here, take lights. They just see no, no lights, streets. I'm ish. I have to keep my phone here so you can see my face. But yes, I'm home. Eric Air delayed our flight, my god. My flight was for 2.40, but we ended up leaving Lagos by 3.40. We left Lagos to Joss, we didn't come to Lagos. Like, they did this thing where they joined. See, I don't know what happened, but I don't have strength to even tell you the gist. But they carried Lagos, they carried Abuja and Joss passengers, and they went to Joss first to drop the Joss passengers. Then they brought us to Abuja. That's why I'm getting home by 6 something most time i have a watch 704 according to the itinerary i was supposed to be home by latest five but well, arik air eh, arik eh, keep me for rude since look at me look i'm sweating like i'm i'm emotionally distraught on top of all of this and i'm sweating and and arik eh, not just bring me home straight anywho i'm home at least i don't reach the home and i'm alone feels <laughs> This house doesn't know me alone anymore. I used to be in this house, I used to live alone in this house before Olayinka came back to join me in Nigeria. But now this house is just like, I don't know you alone, bitch. <laughs> Where your wife at? And also, there's no fall because I tried to own the gen and the gen tank was completely empty. So I think I'm going to be. I'm going to be in darkness today, but don't worry, I have candles. I prepared. As much as I would like electricity, I really do not think I want to own the gen. That's why I'm not going to stress about going out to buy foil. I don't want the gen on. I want complete, total silence. Honestly, they don't give me lighting and carry on. But I just want this night to be quiet, calm as possible. I also want it to be cool. So I want AC, I need AC, but like, nepa. Nepa. Anywho, my candles are on. I'll just position them in different places in the house. Where do you go? When I close my eyes When I finally realize you're not here with me Where do you go? Ola Inka, Ola Inka has left the country She has not left me Ola Inka has left Nigeria <laughs> Hey God Babe <laughs> I'm just trying to just distract myself as possible. As in, they try to know, no think I'm making no worry me. If I reason now, it will worry me. But babe, ah, ah. But it was a very good run also. I haven't run in such a long as well because we've been traveling and moving around for a while now. For like about a month. I mean, the past few months have been very unstable because, you know, we've been preparing for all of this. Anywho, I had a good run. I think I should end this video here because, I don't know, <laughs> I keep carrying this vlog in mind. I keep thinking I want to show you so I don't forget because once I sink into myself, I forget things. But if I wrap up the vlog here, I can just sink into myself. Olenka wrote me a letter the day we were leaving this house. She left later in the house when we were leaving for Lagos. She said when I come back, I should read it. I haven't read it yet because I came back last night, late last night, and I had read the one she gave me yesterday morning and it was very... It was just what I needed for the day, right? So I was saving that one for today because I didn't know how today was going to go. But I thank God for how the journey was because it was... I, I was dreading yesterday. We, both of us were dreading yesterday. 
but she got on the plane and there was Wi-Fi, we could chat on WhatsApp, so all through the ride, all through the flight, except when she was sleeping of course, but all through the ride she tell me what was going on, we could chat and it was really good for both of us, like we kept on saying thank God, thank God for this, we are still staying connected, she has already landed and somebody's there for her, somebody came to get her at the airport, like I don't, I, okay, we didn't make the video to tell you what was going on, but I think I've got a job in the US and we've been processing for the past few months. Once the letter came through, the lawyer in charge of the case had emailed her a few months ago. That was when we stopped looking for house in Abuja because we, we now realized there was a great possibility for her to leave the country and we had to stop looking for house in Abuja together. And even before we were looking for house together, those of you that have been paying attention on this channel, you've been hearing me say that Yinka would go on somewhere else soon because she has other plans, she has other plans. I don't know if you've caught that, but I've been saying that. And that was one of the reasons we were looking for a smaller apartment because we knew eventually we'll have to stay there alone. So yeah, she has gone, she has left Nigeria, so it's just me now in Nigeria. <laughs> so yes, I'm now a quiet person living existing in Nigeria. My love is not in Nigeria with me, thank God. I'm so grateful because <laughs> Nigeria is way more stressful for me when you guys here I realized because I'm way more paranoid and way more anxious. See, Nigeria is just not safe for anyone. Eh? Nigeria is not safe for anyone but those people who physically it shows that you're different, you, you're, you're queer, <laughs> it's more unsafe for them. Those people who are untraditional in their appearance. Me, I feel like I'm on the spectrum. There are some days where I blend in with the rest. <laughs> there are some days where I'm just like untraditional. Right now, I'm just navigating Nigeria as best as I can. But when baby's here, I worry so much. So now that she's not here, I'm so glad. I'm so glad she can. she gets to be beautiful, queer, amazing, caviar sea in a land that people will not be looking at her as if she's a sin. I mean, she gets to face other, you know, problems like racism and all of that but we'll talk about that from that day but for right now we have at least you know checked out homophobia <laughs> from the list so yeah i'm back home and i'm grateful for being back home i'm grateful for these changes i'm grateful for everything that's happening in my life honestly i'm grateful for everything that's happening in my baby's life in our life in our home i'm grateful for our union i'm grateful that people are here also to witness and be our witness our lovers and our friends ah this is where i like to end the video because i want to go and read that little house telling about that life i left for me to read i'm not ready to <laughs> i want to go and read it then after i do i probably get emotional so I just want to lie down listening to loud music. I'll go and shower soon. Oh no no no. I want to yoga a bit. Oof, I want to stretch a bit. I'll figure it out. So you push go. I'll figure my own self out. Thank you for being with me. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for loving us. I love you. The end word for this video. This roundup for everything that's been going on video is congratulations. Yes. We are accepting congratulations, congratulations, congratulations. That is what we are accepting. No other word is permitted. Congratulations. No, sorry, oh, no, what are you sorry for? <laughs> congratulations. If you're happy and you know, type congratulations. <laughs> congratulations. Write congratulations in the comment section down below to let me know that you got here, that you love this video, that you loved me. Or loved me or love me <laughs> that you love me still you love me um so let me know that you're here with me you're rooting for me and um i love you i love you thank you 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 guys witnessing my love and my life and rooting for me i love you thank you so much all right come on be going i need to rest do not forget as you're witnessing my life my love my everything i want to be your reminder for self love yourself love yourself be yourself be in yourself be gentle with yourself pamper yourself be friends with yourself connect to yourself connect with yourself know your boundaries know your capacity love yourself accept yourself hold yourself pamper yourself honestly baby yourself be everything that you need to yourself be what you want to yourself first all right loving yourself is a line you be the first person on that line every other person that loves you should fall behind you nobody should be in front of you in the line of loving you go ye into the world and be beautiful bye